Are you also scared that AI might take over the UX design jobs? Or maybe just wondering these AI tools are more hype than help. But here's the truth. AI isn't here to replace us. It's here to supercharge us. Magic. Imagine cutting your design time into half, getting the sharper insights in seconds, and having an extra creative partner like 24-7. Hey, wait a minute. That's not true. Sounds good, right? In today's video, I am going to walk you through top five AI tools that every UX designer needs in 2025. Tools I personally use to make my work faster, smarter, and way more fun. Hello everyone, I am Shraddha, a senior product designer based in London and on this channel I share real world design tips, career hacks and the coolest tips to help you grow as a designer. If you want to save time, design smarter and wow your team, then this video is for you. So let's jump right in without wasting any seconds. So the first and my most favorite tool is lovable.dev. You can build your apps and websites by chatting with AI. Isn't it cool? So let me first introduce what is lovable.dev. So I want to start by giving it a prompt. Create an end-to-end -end flow for a SaaS startup offering AI-powered UX tools with a hero section, headline, call to action button, where user can interact with and test and try. I can also attach images. I can attach the Figma file based on what I want. I can import the files from Figma here. But let's see in this case, when I click enter, let's wait what it's going to come up. So fingers crossed. wow it came up with something like a really fancy SaaS tool and it says design better ux with ai intelligence and it's like an end-to-end -end flow and the name of the tool is ux ai so it's basically an ai color palette generator so it has given me the whole website with the hero section with the headlines i can play around see i mean when i'm saying warm coffee shop colors it's kind of generating more colors for me can you look how cool is that? It has generated an AI color palette generator using the prompt that I gave. So basically getting the AI SaaS tool using the AI tool with the AI prompt. It's so fun and it's so amazing. Just give it a try. And if you want to think of anything like out of the box, if you're looking for any inspiration, it's good to go. And this is the best part of the lovable. And also it's like, if you want to make a change to this website, you can chat with the AI and it will make a changes and it will give you all end-to-end -end flow the way you give the prompt. This is perfect for designers, PMs, and the stakeholders who want to test ideas quickly, launch the MVPs or show working prototypes to clients without waiting weeks for a dev build. So instead of staring at a blank code editor, you focus on the idea and let lovable dev bring it to the life. It's like having your own on-demand dev team powered by AI. My second most favorite tool is figjam.ai. It's been really good for me for the brainstorming and the collaboration. It is one of the fun tools to use in my daily life. It helps you to generate templates with FigJam AI. You can use a pre-built prompt or you can write your own prompt. It will help you to sort out the stickies. It can summarize your summary. And you can also bring in the power of ChatGPT here. So you can kind of take help of a ChatGPT to give the prompt. And I love how colorful it is how fancy it looks and it just makes the designer's life super easy. So let's go and try it out. 
So in this case, I'll give a prompt for my brainstorming session. So brainstorm for features in a fitness app to help users uh, to get uh, healthier. So it has given me the whole layout where I can collaborate with my team members, my stakeholders. I don't really have to spend my time in this. I can just go and start my workshop right after I get this template. How cool is that? No, I mean, we have saved like a day with this. And then if I want to optimize these stickies for a topic, with behalf to color, you want to summarize these stickies, you have everything. So let's say if your workshop is done and now you want to summarize whole of these templates, use the FigJam AI and you are good to go. The next and the third favorite tool for me is the Notion AI, your smart workspace. Managing projects and notes gets easier with the Notion AI. I use it to generate project briefs, meeting summaries, and even write the user personas. So I usually uh, document my YouTube scripts and everything in Notion. Um, so in this case, let me demonstrate how I use it. Um, so this is one of my script that I use, and I'll give a prompt uh, to the Notion AI that uh, write me a short script for my YouTube channel on the topic, uh, how to stand out in design portfolio crowd. So let's see what I get. So you can see it's giving me with like minute wise, what you want to show, show some examples. And if I want to accept it, I can accept the script. See how clean and actionable that is. It helps me to organize my thoughts and share progress without spending hours writing. So my next favorite tool is chat gpt i'm sure everyone is aware of it but i want to show you how i use it for the ux design so let's see instead of just chatting casually i use it to draft interview questions analyze user feedback or even write micro copy so let me show you uh, i'll give it a prompt now so saying write five open-ended interview questions to understand how users manage projects tasks on mobile apps now uh, ChatGPT is generating questions. So let's see what I will get. Um, so you can see how the AI crafts the thoughtful question that you can use immediately use in your user interviews. And here is a pro tip for you all. Pair ChatGPT's output with your actual user data to generate the insights and the new ideas in order to improve your designs. And you will see how quick and how magical it is. So I've got few five open-ended questions, but now if I kind of give the prompt again, so please use wipe, uh, please use wise as an app reference. So I want to use the actual data basically. So imagine I'm working in a wise company. So it will take wise app as a reference, and then it will give me the top five open-ended questions to ask those things in the user interviews. So you'll see how magical it gets when you start giving more detailed prompts. You're gonna love it. My next and the last favorite tool is the Dovetail AI. It helps me to organize and analyze my user research. So let's see what it does. Now, organizing and analyzing research can be a pain. That's why I love Dovetail AI. It automatically transcribes interviews, tags, feedbacks, and creates the summaries. So now watch this. I have just uploaded a user interview audio file. It also has a video attached to it. Now I'll ask it to transcribe my file. So the AI transcribes it fast and highlights the key themes like onboarding frustration or feature request or any pain point that user is asking for. I can create the shareable reports for my team in minutes way faster than the manual note taking. So if we are also doing research, Dovetail is must have and it's super quick. If you have ever spent an hours on listening to your user interviews and you are kind of finding that one golden quote, then you are going to love this tool, Dovetail AI. 
So that was a quick tour of the top five powerful AI tools that every UX designer needs in 2025, all with the live examples you can start exploring right now. I will link all these tools and the prompt examples below in my description so you can follow me along easily. Also, drop me in the comment section which tools are you excited to try about. And drop your thoughts or any questions you have. I love to hear from you. If you also enjoyed this tutorial style video, please hit like, subscribe and ring that bell button for more practical UX tips and the AI hacks. See you next time. Until then, happy designing and happy exploring. Have a good one. Bye bye.